You have the Vortex HD65 and you want to learn how to take the back cover off so that you can either change the SIM chip or add an SD card or even change the battery. Let's learn. So the easiest way I found is to locate the little tiny divot that helps you take the back cover off. And you'll notice that a lot of the modern phones have a, have a SIM pocket on the side. This one does not. This one, the whole back comes off. So if you bought it new, you already know this. Uh, but if you have trouble, most people can fit their fingernail right in that edge. Let me highlight that edge so that you can see that they make, they make an edge right there that you can get your fingernail on. So most people could just put their thumbnail or fingernail on there and then pry it a little bit like this to get it going. Pry it a little bit to get it going. <laughs> uh. All right, so now I have to do what I'm going to teach you, which is grab a pen or a marker. A Sharpie doesn't work that great, but a pen like this with a, with a 90 degree edge or a sharper edge works way better. And what you want to do is you don't want to hold the phone at the edge like this because the, the cover doesn't flex that much. You want it to come out, you want to hold the phone about in half, halfway. And then you're going to put the pen here and push forward like that. There we go. Now we got it. And then put your pen down, empty your hand so you can do work. And the phone will flex a little bit and you should be able to get the back cover off just like that. So you'll notice here that your SIM chip and your SD card go here. And let me insert a sample SD card or SIM chip. And it always goes metal facing down in the vortex. And then if you wanted to remove it, some phones have a little spring-loaded door where you push it a little bit more and it comes out. This one does not. So if you have trouble getting purchase and you can't just slide it out with your finger, I have another trick for you. I use a big sewing needle. And what I do is I'll push the sewing needle down a little bit into the plastic like that and start scooching it out. And I should, should now have enough room to get it and it does it if I make I made a little dent and that doesn't matter because nothing happens on this side you don't want to be so hard that you destroy the sim chip and now let me show you how to do the same for the SD card so let me get an SD card and what you'll you'll see is that when you go to add an SD card it lays right on top of this slot and it slides right in and that's it. it. Very gently push it in all the way. It should go in about this way. And the neat thing about the SD cards, the SD cards have a little bit of a lip. So if you need to change SD cards, you'll do it like this. Or you'll do it easily. So let me put, and then the, to put the back back on, you just line up the camera slot. And then you go all the way around the phone and just close up like that. Make sure it clicks. And then you'll notice that in the vortex it's very nice that it helps you set up your sd card so you can set up your tap to go and it'll help you how do you want to use your sd card use it for extra phone storage for apps files and media on this phone only or for portable storage where you put data or photos on the sim on the sd card and then remove it and then put it on to another device like your computer or another phone if you need to do it that way all right, that is it. That is how you open the back of your Vortex HD65, change your SIM chips, change your SD card, or change your battery. If this has helped you, please like, please subscribe, and thank you for watching.